What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back. Guys, thanks for all the support. As per usual, before I start the video, drop 10k in the comments. Like the vid, sub if you are new. Let's get this vid to 70 likes for a chance. One of my subs or whoever comments will win 10k. You just gotta get the video to 70 likes and drop a comment. And that's all you gotta do. Any comment, you could just say 1k. We're about to get 1k this week, man. We're getting closer and closer to 1k. Thank you guys so much. This video is the aftermath of the market crash. I think it's episode 5. But yeah, man. We made mad stubs off this one. Probably around like, probably around over 30k. We're going to get into it. But man, guys, thank you for all the support. It's been awesome. Uh, some guys, for some reason, I refreshed today and I gained 17 likes in a minute. I don't know if that's a bot. But that is weird. Even if you dislike the video, I don't care because that helps my channel getting recommended. So if you want to dislike and be a hater... Thank you for that because that helps my channel. So thanks for that. Anyways, let's get into the video. So what I noticed, I told a lot of people to invest in Baez. And the problem is that his edge is still down. So I cannot make stubs off him right now. I'm literally, I can't make any stubs. I have three, three of him. His edge must go up to make stubs. His edge is down. This is the time you want to get him. I bought him for 30, 30k, three of them for 30k, and he's at 33, so I will not make stubs until he goes up because his edge is down. So, right now, let's just say I made 1k off three of them. I got all of them for 3k. If I sell them for 34, I'll make 3k off all of them. So, right now, we're at 3k. Chris Bryan was my best investment this week. I made about 6k clean off him. If I sell him for 27, I got him for 19. I got two of them for 19k. He's at 27. If I sell him, I'll make about 6K clean after reduction. Uh, 6 times 2 is 12. We got 3K from the buyers. So that's 15K already made. Let's get into some more investments, guys. This series has been going very well for me. I've been making mad stubs ever since the market crash. Every time the market crashes. So right now, Machado is at 46,333. So right now, I got him for 41. I'm not going to make the most stubs. I'm not going to make the max stubs, but I'm going to make 2K off each clean. 2K off each clean. We're at 50K plus 4, 90K. So we're at 90K off those investments. So we're already at about 20K stubs made. I'm waiting for Machado to go up to more 50K because uh, I know he will. He usually does every single week. I'm just hoping he does. Let's get another inside edge up tomorrow. He will be around 48, 50K. So if you guys have Machado, I would hold on to him. I think he's going to keep going up. And yeah. Let's get into the next one. Let's see what we invested in. Uh, let's see. We got, what's this one? 19K. Let me move the face cam quick. We got Chris Brown. We got Brad Peacock. Brad Hand. Uh, okay, perfect. Josh Hatter. Okay. Let's put the face cam back on. Hater, I should say. Josh Hater. Uh, he's actually been amazing. I made so many stubs off both haters. Off both haters, I made 10K clean. I literally got him for about 21k. He's at 32. I sold both of them yesterday for 34. I got 32k. I made 10k clean off each hater, bro. So 90k plus 20k. That is 39k made off the one market crash. So that is insane. We literally made 40k off a bunch of diamonds. I invested about 300k. We made 40k. That is awesome. That is about 50% increase in stubs. And we have more. We have more. Uh, what's it called? We have more completed auctions. I'm going to go over a lot of my investments. And I'm going to see if I made money off my bronzes as well. So I told you guys to invest in Hunter Dozier. Unfortunately, he did get hurt. But okay. So I invested in 91. I have 36. I got last one for 91 stubs. He's at 140. Right there. That's 30 stubs easily. And he's injured right now. I'm not selling my Dozier. He's going to come back strong. I have feel like... Dozier's back 312 on the season. He's batting very well. He's a first all, he's an all-star first ballot right now. He's gonna hopefully make the all-star game. Hopefully he comes back clean, not hurt, and he'll come back strong. So yeah, aftermath of the market crash is looking pretty deadly right now. We're we're about a, we're up we're at about 40k stubs off this one already. And I just want to check more investments, see what's going on. So we got Machado. Um we pulled one of Machado's. Okay. Okuna 4K. Oh, I forgot to mention my Altuve's. Okay. So Altuve, I got both of them for 24. And he is at 31. Okay, this is perfect. I will make a ton of stubs off Altuve. And right now, I'll be selling one. I'll make about, what, 31K. I got him for 24. Minus 3K. 
28k i'll make about 4k off each we're at 39k plus 8k uh 47k made already so 47k made is perfect uh if you guys listen to me you're lit you're gonna make stubs like i did if you didn't eh, it sucks for you I'm going to look at Austin Riley. I heard Austin Riley. I saw him the other day for 30K by now. I tried getting him. I got overcut. He's at 38K. If you guys got him for 30K by now and sold him for 38K, you're valid. You made about 4K stubs each. You made a ton of stubs off Mr. Riley. You're lit. I know my boy EH Hornets, one of my OG supporters, my OG subs. Shout out to you. I know you picked him up and you're going to make a ton of stubs off him. About 5K stubs clean. You're lit. So... Let's keep going. Let's see what else I got over here in the completed. Uh, let's see. We got Volaback for 60. We got Brad Hand for 1K. Let's check Brad Hand. Let's see how many stubs I made off hand. I don't think I made that many. Uh, I think it should be get it going on great. Okay. I only made like 100 stubs off each. Not the best, but it's not the worst. Uh, we got Volaback for 60 stubs, which is crazy because Volaback's very freaking good. He's at 120 stubs. He's still at 52 by now. I will be picking up more. Because that's too cheap. Vogelback is a stud, in my opinion. He hits nukes. I think he gets upgraded soon. And yeah, I made a couple stubs off him. About 100 stubs. What do we have? 47k now. Let's see what else we got in the completed auctions. Guys, thank you for the support once again. It's been lit. I really, really, I really just love it, man. And guys, don't forget to come to the stream, man. We're streaming at 915 every single day this week. We are grinding after work, bro. We're coming after work and we're grinding for all of you guys. Oh my god, I forgot to mention, if you guys have Trevor Story investments, he must have went up a ton, because the man went off yesterday. Yes, he's at 4k. So, I have 20 of them. I got all of them for under 2k. Guys, if you listen to me, Trevor Story went off yesterday. Two dingers. I'm pretty sure he went three for four. Bro, Trevor Story. I made a ton of stubs off him. I have 20. I made a minimum of 2k off all of them. 2k all of them, 2 times 20, that's 40k stubs, bro. He's going to go diamond. I know he's going diamond. His stats on a diamond card, if his vision goes up to a 50, his stats will be literally a 90 overall diamond for 85 price. So this card right here is the stub making method right here. If you guys have the story, you're making mad stubs. Let's see. We got Okuna. I got Okuna for 4k, 4,500. Oh, I should have typed in more. We made a ton of stubs. Let's just say we're at about... 50k stubs right now i made more but whatever okay so right now first of all this is the time to invest his price gap is beautiful you can literally make stubs off him now if he plays good the next two weeks he goes diamond automatically we need to pray to pray to the lords pray that will be gods pray that okuna goes off this week if he hits five dingers in the next two weeks he will be going diamond and if he goes diamond i'll be starting him just because i'm obsessed with okuna he is my fantasy starter. Oh my god, what is going on over here? He is my fantasy starter for so long, man. He's a he's a stud. I'm obsessed with Okuna. 4,500 stubs, the time to invest. I made a ton of stubs off him already. I got all of them for 4, 4,500. So I'm going to make a K off each. A K times 10, 10K. We're at 60K stubs already made. Just off this one market crash every Friday. Like I say, the market crash is every single Friday. It's that simple. If you don't agree, I don't care. It crashes every Friday. And honestly, you'll see in all my videos that it just crashes. Like you you can't even argue. So let's just let's just sell my Altuve. And also, I'm pretty sure I invested in a couple of let's see. Let's see what else I invested in. See what stubs I made. We got Rue. Rue might be up a lot. Okay. This guy's been pitching gems like crazy. Yeah. So Rue's up. I only got one. I'm going to make about 500 stubs off one. Man, honestly, this might be the last time you can invest in him before he goes up. Ru, Ryu, I don't know how to say his name, bro. I knew this guy for a while. When he came to the league, I always looked at him. And I think he's finally breaking out and turning to an ace. This guy is literally playing like an ace. This might be the last chances you can invest in him. Because mad people are going to try to invest in him. So, yeah, uh, I made some stubs off him. And honestly, yeah, we made about over 50K stubs on this um aftermath of the market crash i'm just gonna try to check uh abreu actually before we end the video uh jose abreu so he's 710 he's at 535 great time to invest let's see if he made any stubs 450 all right i made some decent stubs by selling for 710 200 stubs a piece times 10 2k stubs so let's just say we made about 50k stubs we made more but let's just say 50k stubs 
So if you guys listen to me, you made about 50k stubs. If you have like 200k, 250k to invest in, which a lot of my subs do, they said. So that's lit. Honestly, guys, I hope you I hope you enjoyed the video. This is episode five. Thank you guys for coming out. Thank you for showing me support. Drop the like for 10k. We're streaming later tonight. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Hey, yo,